gonna get so much backlash if I say this, but I'm gonna have to keep it real with y'all. Xavier is giving me the guy from. If you know me from my first channel, you know that one of my favorite games is what? F M K. So you know what we're gonna play today? We're gonna play Big Brother F M K. Yep. Au lieu d'aller à travers les portraits in order of what we have seen the people, you know, because that's a little boring. We're just going to play FMK on the BB, BB23 house guest, okay? So we have Kyland, okay, Kyland, he's half Mexican and half Black, half African American, Kyland. Xavier, okay, Xavier, sorry, Xavier, okay, the lawyer. I don't know why he said he was a bartender for in his bio, like, bro, why don't you just say straight up that you're a lawyer as well, you know? Because if people figure it out afterwards, they're not going to be happy about it. Oh, you were trying to hide it because you didn't want to seem smart, right? Mm. And then the last one, oh, Kylan again. Sorry, we have to pick another one. Kylan, this thing keeps picking Kylan. Brittany, Brittany, okay, first female person in this roster. Okay, so Kylan, Kylan, you know, Kylan's presentation was a little too like preachy for me like i'm so good i help i help children you know am i a hater he's cute but i was just like oh i <laughs> you know the virtue signaling thing is like something that's a little annoying to me but you know i like him kind of kylan okay so he said he's an account executive he lives in venice california um he basically brings kid to an urban saddle um, and he gives like scholarships to kids who want to go to college. I think that was him. Um, he says that he has two cultures. He's African American and Mexican. Xavier, okay, Xavier is the lawyer. He said because he wanted to be a lawyer because he wants to help people. Bro, you are in the wrong profession if you want to help people because people got to pay for lawyers. You know what I mean? Like, I don't believe that, that you're going to be a lawyer just because you want to help people. He said that he um, played college basketball, but tore his ACL. Yo, I feel like everyone on this cast was like an athlete in college and they were playing professionally. He said that he's single, but um, he wants to avoid showmances. I don't believe that. They all say that because they know that as fans, that's what we want to hear, but we know it's not true. Um, so yeah. And then last one is Brittany. Brittany says that she has autism, but you know, like, I think autism is a spectrum, first of all. And um, she said that she was a valid valedictorian. And I'm assuming maybe she was a valedictorian and she's smart. Maybe her brain is related to her autism. A lot of people with autism are actually, I mean, surdoué, you know? They're like smarter than the average person. So yeah, so she she's a teacher, but she has a master's in science and education. She did two majors, was valedictorian. She played karate since she was 12. She won three times world championships or something. Um, yeah, and I was like, yo, protect Brittany at all costs. This girl better not get bullied. You know what? What's funny? Yeah, uh, um, let me, oh, oh, I see new people. David, David Alsep. Hey, I love the episode, to be honest. You know what? You know what? I feel like the end of the episode was better. Let me tell you. Okay. Let me tell you my impressions of like the whole thing. Okay. I find the, the whole thing of like groups and four and then after playing a game is boring. Like the first part of the, the game is boring. Don't do it like that because it's not exciting. The game is boring. There are no stakes. So I think the first minutes of the show should be dedicated to people getting to know each other and seeing those bonds form. I do not care to see the intro packages and to see people playing that stupid boring game for like an hour. What I liked about the episode, first of all, I love the way the teams were made. The fact that it was kind of, it wasn't a random, right? Because they did it on purpose to have two people present their, uh, like, sorry, they did it on purpose to have two people who have like kind of the same background be presented at the same time. Um, yeah, so I, I like the way the teams were made. I'm going to look through my notes afterwards to see what else did I like. Because I remember I liked a few things. But yeah. Oh, by the way, the concept for the game. I feel like the concept 
for the game is um is what I've said on my other channel. If you watch BBQC recaps, I suggested that kind of a secret story kind of thing be done. If you haven't watched Secret Story, it's the French version of Big Brother, and they have missions every week, and they have like um, dilemmas they have to take to increase their cash prizes and all of that. So yeah, so a little inspired by that. Are they listening to me? Okay, so Alec, you said Mary Kyland. Oh, wait, wait, let me go back. Sorry, sorry. Let me go back in order, okay? Um, so Sasu said, Sasu said, fuck Kyland, Mary Xavier, and K. Brittany. Oh, 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 oh. I got hecka band. That's the last thing. Why you doing that? That's the last thing. Oh, y'all so fake. Y'all made a plastic. Uh, uh. Okay, let me see what you guys are saying. So you both, I feel like, okay, you, got, you guys both said the same thing. Let me see if I agree. Something about Xavier. I don't know. I don't know. But, oh, I don't know. This one is hard. This one is hard. No, sorry. Yeah, so sorry. Brittany's going to take the K. I'm so sorry, Brittany, because I do like you. You like them all, too. I like them, too. Um. So, yeah, so we're going to... Um, K, Brittany. Oh, Mary, Mary, you like them all. Okay, I'm just realizing. Oh, my God. Lol. <laughs> you said marry them all. Yes, yes. Okay, no, but you can't. That's not the bl That's not the game. That's not how it goes. That's not how it goes. Um. So, M... Brittany. Um, no, so it's gonna have to K Brittany. I'm gonna have to marry Kyland and F Xavier. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna go for. I think I'm so you know what, Sasu, we're opposites. So you said Mary Xavier means the opposite. I'm gonna marry Kylan and F Xavier. And sorry, Brittany, because I like you, girl. Um, so David, David said. Oh, let me read the comments faster because I'm being so slow. So David said, Team Joker since the beginning. Who's Team Joker? Is Team Joker with my queen, Azza? I think so. Let me let me check for Jokers. I think me too. I was rooting for Team Joker because they had Azza and they had Derek. Oh, man. Now I look I look like a wasp list. But it's really, it's a coincidence, okay? But I'm rooting, yes, Azza. And I like Britney. Yes. Team, you know what? Yes, I'm rooting for Jokers. Yes, yes, yes. I like Britney, okay? So, yes, Team Jokers. I like Derek. And Frenchie, I like him because he called my girl a queen. And I was like, okay, you're winning cool points with me. So, yeah, Alex said pre Team Joker is pretty lit. Yes, 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 yes. David said, I was rooting for Derek and Azza. So glad they're on Team Joker. Okay, yes, we were rooting for the same people. Okay, okay I'm so happy we're rooting for the same people. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Um, I didn't really like Xavier. Me neither. Something, something about him, you know? But it's based on first impressions. So, like, I don't know him. But the whole, like, oh, I'm a bartender. <laughs> He, he doesn't seem real. You know what I mean? Like, be yourself. Be real. Stop putting up a facade. You know what I mean? So, yeah, Derek, I was like, mm, mm, mm. that's what Derek was giving me. The whole cast was fantastic, but the team kings seem hella shallow. Yeah, um, yeah, I, I, think, I think you're right because, um, wait, let's see what was the choices for team kings. So, in the first round, it was between Alyssa and Tiffany. And it was, um, and Alyssa, her prompt was, um, she designs, he, she's a co-owner of a swimwear brand. Whereas Tiffany said, she's a mom of a teenage son. Which one sounds more appealing to you? I would go with the swimwear designer because no shade, okay? No shade. But we don't have a lot of Karens. Karens, BB, Big Brother Canada 5, or who was older last season? Or Tina or Tara, we don't have a lot of good older people in Big Brother USA. So as a young person, I see the bias. We don't like ageism, right? But it's more of a pattern. Like, okay, people who tend to be older and love their kids tend to complain a lot about wanting to see their kids and wanting to go home. And also Christian wanted to be in a showman's. So for sure he was gonna pick Alyssa, who is stunning, by the way. I mean, Alyssa is Alyssa, so Christian was obviously going to go with his showman's option. The second round, it was between Xavier 
and Derek, Xavier said something, something Zingbot. I really missed that part. I didn't hear it. So if someone heard what Xavier said about the Zingbot, tell me. And then Derek said he likes to make people laugh. Yo, I love Derek from the interview I watched on, I think it was ET Canada, if I'm not mistaken. So yeah, to me, Derek was one of my favorite from, from Jump. From Jump. Um, please, Xavier could get all of me. Oh, girl. I mean, he has a lot going for him. Ooh, I'm going to get so much backlash if I say this. Until. Ooh. Okay, look. I don't like to be prejudiced, okay? I don't like to be prejudiced, okay? But I'm going to have to keep it real with y'all. Xavier is giving me the guy from The Bachelor. What was his name? Was it Eric? Was it Eric Bachelor? Was it Eric his name? No, it's not Eric. Bachelor. Who's the Black Bachelor? What's his name? Oh, man, I forgot. Matt James. Matt James. Xavier is giving me Matt James, okay? And sorry, this is just based off of first impressions, but he's going to have to prove me wrong about that, okay? This is what Xavier is giving me. I'm so sorry. This is not politically correct, but this is what he's giving me.